Yeah, I'd, I'd really like to encourage um, everybody to, to, to come. We, we've, uh, we've especially encouraged our ministry leaders to come in to, um, and, and to invite different people who are involved in ministries to adore our Lord because we can't be uh, a parish that is centered on um, evangelization and on making disciples if we aren't first disciples ourselves. So um, our focus on our Eucharistic Lord, our focus on our own um, relationship with Him, our, the focus on our own um, spiritual lives is going to help us to reach out more to others as well and to share the good news that we have first uh, encountered um, in, in our own spiritual lives. So being able to pray in the middle of the night, it, it kind of reminds me, at least my first prayer is I would pray in, in the night, right, um, just before going to bed. So maybe there's something about that um, that makes it a really special time to, to pray uh, together in the church. Uh, everything's a little quieter. Um, maybe, <laughs> maybe for me as a priest, not having a family, it's a quieter, maybe not for everybody. <laughs> Um, but there's some people who are coming in, in the middle of the night, like at 3 a.m., to adore our Lord. And, and that's uh, a really beautiful time when, again, the world is silent. And the Lord's asking us for a little bit of time uh, to spend uh, before Him. So I think it's a great opportunity for us to come together as a parish community to adore our Lord.